the weeks ahead, parents, teachers, and students will begin back to school shopping. The supply list can seem especially long for students whose families are homeless. For the fourth year in a row, the Cumberland County Register of Deeds Office is collecting school supplies to donate to the Fayetteville Police Department for distribution to homeless students in the Cumberland County school system. Pam Stoltz and Lisa Scales are helping coordinate this year's drive and provide details on how you can help. Every summer, the Register of Deeds Office, under the leadership of Lee Warren, conducts a book bag program for the many homeless children we have right here in Cumberland County. Um, the students are given a list of items to bring in that are required for them to bring into their classrooms and our homeless children just cannot afford to bring those items in. So our staff of 24 gets together and tries to help them in some small way. We supply some of those items and the book bag to put them in for them to take into their classrooms. The items that we are collecting are crayons and markers, pens and pencils, colored pencils, glue sticks, erasers, notebook paper, binders, folders, and in addition to that, we um, would like to have tissue, hand sanitizer, toothbrushes, and toothpaste. And we have also um, been so lucky to get Walmart gift cards that the public and the citizens have donated. We ordered the book bags. They're bright neon mesh book bags. Um, beautiful colors, and they're see-through. Fayetteville Police Officer Stacy Sanders comes into our office to obtain birth certificates for the homeless. So uh, that first year, it was about two weeks before school started, and she was telling us about all the homeless children school in the school system here. And we were just shocked. We could not believe that there were that many here. We are a very team-oriented office, so when we learned of the, the homeless children that were just right here in Cumberland County, we just all pitched in. We had two weeks to get it together that first year. We all pitched in and made it happen. We are collecting here at the Register of Deeds office. We're in the courthouse in room 114, and we're collecting now up until around August the 10th, and anything that we get after that, we're also, we can use the next year. Like we have back here, we have a few items that are left, so we're using those this year. We turn the, the book bags, the supplies, the book bags over to the uh, Federal Police Department, and we'll do that probably 10 days prior to school starting. Anyone that would like to donate, whether it's big or small, is very appreciated, and it makes a difference. It makes a difference. According to the school system and the Fayetteville Police Department, it is our understanding that there are around 800 homeless school children right here in Cumberland County. We feel that there is a great need and we just could not stand by and not do something to help. Even though maybe what we do is not that much, it is just so rewarding to know that a child can go into the school the first day and have some things to take in. The parents can do something about their life, but a child has no choice, and that, that is really what got us into this. It just broke our hearts that the little children didn't have anything for themselves or to contribute to their class. Anyone that has questions in reference to the book bag drive, they can contact um, the Register of Deeds Office at 678-7775. The response from the public greatly determines how much we have to supply, how many book bags we can supply. Last year, Don Chase with WKML did a tremendous job in getting the word out. Many, many businesses and individuals would just come by our office and drop by supplies and we make it all work out. Someone might bring 20 of something and someone might bring 50 of something else, pencils or something, but we make it all work out. And on behalf of the Register of Deeds Office, I would like very, very much to thank everyone who contributed to this need.